Hi everyone, and this is uh, Richard, uh, Legend Board Game Fanatic, and today we're going to be doing Eldritch Horror from Fantasy Flight. And this is by Corey Korniska and Nikki Valens, and it's kind of based on the same type of game as Arkham Horror. There's a lot, a few changes, and the way that you do uh, test is a little bit different. You do not get to re-roll using the... Um, Ability uh, tokens. The only way you can roll, you roll dice is with clues, and clues are very valuable with this game. So we will show you how this is all go, um, done. Um, it's a little bit different. We're traveling around the world trying to uh, to take care of three mysteries, and uh, we will go into which um, monster we're going to be using, and basically my character and how to set up this game. So we will do that um, very soon. If you haven't subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe button. If you like this video after you finish watching it, please hit that like button. And if you have any comments or suggestions or any games that you guys want to see on my channel, please put those in the comment section. I will look at those uh, ASAP uh, as soon as I can, okay? Um, so let's get to it. To I'll just whore. Okay, so setup. Um, basically, we set up all our tokens here. We have our uh, ability tokens that we'll be getting, uh, clue tokens. Um, those normally are face down, but I put them in here just so I don't get to see them. I'll just grab them. We have our edges tokens, our train, uh, train and uh, ship tokens. We'll explain how that goes when we move. We have our uh, um, Health tokens and our um, what is it called again? Uh, exactly. Yeah. Always get the turn, man. Um, sanity tokens. Yeah, that's what it is. Okay, sanity. Uh, then we also have our mystery tokens and uh, rumors, or well, rumors and mystery. Um, we also have our spells, conditions, our assets, and our artifacts here. And I'm playing uh, basically Charlie Kane, the politician. My action is another necessary of your choice. May immediately perform one additional action. When you form an acquire asset action, that means this getting one of these uh, assets. Uh, you may allow other makers to gain cards you purchase. Well, good thing about that is, is using handshaking, and my handshaking is four. So it gives me an opportunity to get some weapons that I need because my strength is two, very low. So I need to start getting assets right away so I have stuff available to fight monsters and stuff like that. All right, um, we also set up um, our uh, Doom Track. The Doom Track starts at 12 with this guy, with Cthulhu. Um, and also we set up our, uh, our track here, depending on our, these are going to be our gates that we put out. And right now, um, here, I thought we had a gate out here. Oh yeah, we do. So right now we have um, one of the red uh, circular gates that's on the bottom. We haven't got to that point yet, and then we've got a Shogoth monster in Sydney. We have that set up. We have a clue in Brennus Arways. We also have exploration um, in Heart of Africa if you want to go there. And um, that's uh, pretty much it. We have all our cards set up. These are our gate cards, all our cards for our different spaces. We have our exp uh, exploration uh, cards that we want to be taking. Um, these are going to be our clue cards uh, for our um, um, Pacific uh, Cthulhu. And then we have our uh, special um, cards that we will be using later on, but not right now. So those are going to be set. And we have one mystery open right now. And uh, it's called Deep Ones Attack. It says, Terrible storms have battered fishing villages across the globe but is merely the prelude to an invading army of deep ones. When your card is displayed, East Investigator places one Eldritch token on the nearest sea space. And I did it, I put it right here next to San Francisco. 
uh, as an encounter investigate on a space containing an algae token may attempt to fend off the Deep One invasion. Deep One monster ambushes him. If he defeats it, he may spend one clue to place the Elder's token on his card. This card. At the end of the Mythos phase, if there are Elder's tokens on this card equal to the amount of players, that'd be one. Solve this mystery. Do not discard the Eldritch tokens from the game board. Okay. So that's our mystery for now. We need to get three mysteries total done. If we do, we win the game. Okay. We also have our monster bag that's already set, ready to go here. Four random monsters. I also have a personal assistant that gains me one more handshake dice. And you may reveal one die when resolving a handshake test. So that's kind of good for me. So the assets are going to be really beneficial for me. Now, the actions that we can do on this thing. Uh, basically, uh, we can travel. Uh, we travel one adjacent space. If we purchase a, uh, we could also uh, prepare to travel and gain one ticket. So like for example, if I want to go on this track train and I want to go um, to London, I would have need a boat. I could probably purchase a boat ticket here because there's a boat, there's a boat here. And I could travel the train and take the boat all the way to London if I want to. So that would give me an extra move there if I do the prepare. Uh, or I can acquire access, test out handshaking, and gain any number of assets to equal or lesser value from the reserve. City spaces without monsters only. You could also rest, and that will give cover one health, one sanity. I only have four, four health, so I need to keep up with my uh, health so I don't die right away. Uh, trading, we don't have any more investigative planes, so uh, no trading is going to be out the window. And then any component actions that I have on my um, character sheet or any of my components that I, assets that I have. Okay, so that's, that's basically the action phase and we get two actions. Then we do an encounter phase where whatever space I'm on, I'm going to do an encounter. And then uh, after that, we do the mental phase and mental phase is where all the bad stuff happens and hopefully I can survive this and get the three mysteries and win. So far I've played twice and I've lost both times. Uh, you know how Arkham Horror is, it's just like that, it escalates, so we're going to try to do the best we can. Um, we'll see how that goes. Alright, so uh, let's get started. So um, basically um, I am going to take a, what do I want to do here first? I need to get, uh, so I want to take a boat ticket. I'll do that. First, take a boat ticket. And um, I think I'm going to um, try to do get an asset. I need something with strength. I, I, there's a 38 revolver here I could use. So I get a total of four, five dice total. So I got four here, so I could roll another dice. So I got one. I get, and so I get to roll. Uh, one more dice, and I missed, so I can re-roll one dice if I want, and I missed. So I only got one. So I can get the 38 revolver because it's a one um, here, so I'll place that here. So now I have, I gain two, I got a total of four dice instead of two. That's awesome. Alright, and that's my turn. Alright, so after I do that, I would have to put another asset out. And the Vatican uh, missionary there. All right, now I'm in San Francisco. There's no uh, expiration tokens, no clue tokens there. Uh, so I'm going to take a um, a green card. So I'll take this one. And San Francisco. So Inspector Jack Mannion is looking for the information about the tongs in Chinatown. If you can help him, he'll teach you the basic police work in exchange. You may spend one clue to improve your observation. The problem is I have no clues. So basically I don't get nothing for this one. Uh, well, that's okay. At least it's nothing bad for me. So that yeah, goes on the bottom of my deck. 
Then I take a Mythos card. And all right, so we move our thing one space, and we do not have any gates uh, with that there, so we're good. Um, it says Club Eyes 1, Advanced Doom by 1 for each gate on the game board that corresponds to the current element. No, we do not. Uh, so that's good for us. All right, then do a uh, the uh, Zaw Reckoning Effects. Monsters on board first. So the slug off says the monster recovers all health. Well, he's already healthy, so he's fine. Okay, then we got uh, each and one sheep. Um, each investor on the C space that does not contain an elder's token places an elder's token on the space. I am not in the C state, so we're good. All right, and then we got um, Methos cards in play. No, we don't have any. Uh, possessions and conditions held by investigators. I don't have any of those. Good. All right, and then spawn gate. So we're going to spawn a gate. And Tokyo gets one. So then, because I um, spawned one, I had to spawn a monster there. And we spawn a cultist. Now, these are, it's got a green marking here, means spawn condition. So use the cultist information as this on H1 sheet. Okay, so we're basically, um, I do a string test and he gives me one hit if I, I don't pass it. Okay, so that's it. All right, so then the event, oh, and I have three different things. So across the globe, headlines announced terrorists that threatened to engulf humanity. An individual everywhere take action against these horrors and assist those who have already been fighting the Ancient One. The world fights back. Event. Each of us can maybe do one of the following. Recover two health. I don't need to. Recover two sanity. No. Or discard one monster from his space. Alright, I don't have any of that stuff. So, basically I didn't get nothing for that. Awesome. Great. Fantastic. Alright, so that's the Mitzvah's face. So, now it's my turn. Um, I'm going to move um, over here, boom, and I will move using my ship movement, so I go here, and it's a city, so I am going to go and roll my dice again for my, see if I can get another item, hope I can do better this time, I got one, so I get one more, Dice and four, so I get three roll one dice. And yes, so we got one. So I can go and get a whiskey. It says, item you may discard this card to prevent an investigator on your space from losing up to two sanity. All right, so I'll take that one and I'll put another one down. We got witch doctor ally, investigator on your space, may recover one additional health or discard a curse condition when performing a wet rest action. Okay, that's my turn. So now we're going to do a search and investigative action uh, for a clue. So I'm going to take the clue action and we're doing a city. So uh, you see dozens of people with the distinct features of Deep One hybrids. They watch you constantly and you have to fight to escape. Okay, so, shoot, alright, um, so I'm fighting, so I can use my revolver, because it is considered a combat condition, so I got 2 plus 2, that's 4, or dice, and hopefully I pass. And I did, I got a six. Okay. So if you pass, you identify more families descended from deep ones. Gain one clue. Awesome, gain one clue. Uh, if, okay, and that's it, done. So, I'll put this back over here on the bottom, and done. All right, so that's my counter phase. But now I will do another mythos. 
All right, so we spawn a clue. Okay, and it goes to number three. So number three is where? Number three is here in the C space. Awesome. Okay, space 16 gets a rumor. Space 16. So that's going to go here. And four. It's, oh, Elder's Token on four. So four get Elder's Token. Four, 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 right here. Okay. Elder's Token. Faded from society. Okay. Uh, some dark magic has taken hold in you. Friends have started ignoring you as if you weren't even in the room. It's getting worse, and you fear that soon you will be invisible to every other person on Earth. Vader from Society, ongoing rumor. As an encounter, an investigator on Space 16 may attempt to research similar occurrences from the past. Observation. Okay, so then we will put this right here. We've got a rumor there. Alright, so it's my turn next. Whew, what do I do now? Let's see, I need to go. It says, spend one clue to place our other stone on this card. So, all right, I'm in a city. So I could do another ship token. And that's what I'm going to do, another ship token. And so I'm going to move here and use my ship token. Move here. Okay, and then I'm going to do another Handshake roll for an asset. I got one. I got two. And then I can reroll one more dice. So let's see. Ooh, three. Let me see what I can do. I got a witch doctor. That would be probably a good idea. So I will get the witch doctor. All right. And puzzle box. Uh, puzzle box. Uh, trinket. When you perform a rest action, you may attempt to open the puzzle box. Observation minus two. If you pass, you may discard this card to gain an artifact. That's kind of cool. All right. All right. So that is my turn, my actions. So I am going to do a event from San Francisco again. All right. You speak to a military prisoner on Alcatraz Island. He tells you the story of deserting after encountering a horrif horrific, horrific creature. Um, so that's going to be my mind thing. I'm going to get two. And I don't have anything that's going to help me with that. So I'm going to get two dice. Hopefully I pass it. And I got five, so I pass. You pass, he thanks you for believing him and blesses your name. Gain a blessed condition. Awesome. So that's going to help you a bit. So I get blessed condition. That's awesome. Um, blessed condition. Blessed, 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 blessed. All right. So now I can get a roll four, five, and six count of successes. If you would gain another blessed condition for this card instead, if you would gain a cursed condition, discard this card instead, and then roll one die on a one or two, discard this card. It one is a um, reckoning effect. Okay, so next thing I do is I do my mythos. So we get gain another we spawn another clue. Um, this clue is gonna go Arkham. Alright. And um, space seven, we have another rumor. Space seven. Space seven. Right here. Okay. Alright, a dozen unpleasant looking strangers have settled into Panama with a large collection of astronomical reference books. There is something unique about this place and time 
and allows them to rip apart the fabric of reality. Star Online. Ongoing rumor. As an encounter, an investigator on phase seven may attempt to find the strangers based on his observation of the stars. Observation. And I got three. So, all right. So, uh, that one's more possible. Oh, both are possible. Um, so, I can do either one of those. But that's closest. Um, all right. So, that is my turn. I was going to go again. Um, so, Yeah, so I'm gonna do the mystery if I can do that. Um, so I'm gonna roll first of all to my um, get another item. So I got two right now. Get to roll one more. Got that one, and then I get to re-roll one dice. So I got two. So I got three. Um, I think I'll take this puzzle box. Okay, good. All right, and then I'm going to move this spot here. Okay, I'm going to put another asset out. Lucky. Oh wow. Let's try. You may add one. The result of one die when it's on my test. Okay, cool. Or a lucky cigarette case. All right. Um, all right. So um, what am I gonna do now? Um, okay. So I am on a C space. So I have to do a C. Oh, as an encounter. That's right. When this card is played, each of us replaces one edge token on the nearest C space that does not contain. Okay. okay. Alright. As an encounter, an investigator on a space containing the edge's token may attempt to fend off the deep one invasion. A deep end monster ambushes him. If defeats it, he may spend one clue to place the elder's token on the card. Okay, so I need the deep one. So the deep one is here, okay, and all right. So I need to do my mines, and I get two. Oosh. Let's see if I have anything for my mind thing. So I get two dice. I don't think I have anything on my thing. No, I don't. I need a four, or five, or six. I got one, so I lose one. Sanity. Okay. Then I'm attacking, so um, minus one, so I got two, four, so I get three dice. Okay. And hopefully I can get this only, this guy's only got two, hopefully I get two dice. I got one. So, so basically I defended against the one, but he gets one, one damage. All right. So, um, it says. May you spend one clue to place that object token on the card. Okay. So, he did not do it. So this goes back here, he didn't defend it. So that basically you can't do anything. All right. All right. Okay. I did that, I didn't get anything. Ah, that sucks. All right, so, um, to do a mythos. Okay, we move this here. And we have one. Let me move 
this is an 11. Okay, so the first thing we do is any, this is, this guy's healed, that's fine. Um, in H1 cheat, we have, um, he's based on a C space that does not contain algebra stone placed in algebra stone in this space. Okay, we already have one there. Okay, and then we got um, Mythos cards. All right, so we got, um, that's omen by one. So we got 10. And it says, search the acid deck, discard pile. Search the acid deck, discard pile, and reserve for all assets that value equal to or greater than the number of Eldritch tokens on this card. And return them to the game box. Then discard one of the tokens from this card. If there are no Eldritch tokens on this card, solve this rumor. Huh. Okay, so we solved it. So this is gone. All right, good. All right, and then I got to roll, I need to roll a dice. I got six, that's good. All right, and that's it. Then we got to, to spawn another, you can get London. And then I need to do another. Monster and it's a ghoul. Okay, then it says, You hear it again and again on the news. Every day the world takes another step toward utter annihilation. You ask yourself, How much would you sacrifice to prevent the disaster? Even if you could only grant hum humanity one more day of existence, could you honestly say that the price was too high? Desperate times. Doom advances by two unless the lead investigator gains a dark path condition. All right. Um, okay. I am going to have to do that. So I will take a dark path condition. It's not good, but I will take a dark path condition. All right. Okay. Wow. This is, I don't have to get anything else here. Okay. So I got, I got the last one. I lost, luckily I haven't lost any, um, else yet. Okay. So, I guess I'll try again in a second. Um, so I will go here, go here, um, uh, let's see, I will get a vote token, you know what, do that, or no, I want to do that, you know what, no, I am going to do my asset thing, so, let's see. So I got one, two, I roll one more. I got three, and I re roll one dice. I got three. Um, I can get the, the game one. I need that. So I will take the Vatican Missionary. Missionary, and I gain one plus one, so now I'm at three. And I may re-roll one down when it's on my test. Uh, my test. Okay, so that's good for me. All right, so I'll put another. Get dynamite. Ooh, I can use that. Okay. All right. So that is my turn. So I will do another encounter on San Francisco. All right. It says you meet Hammond. A formal Pinkerton agent on the streetcar and try to convince him to teach you how to be a detective. Handshake. Perfect. So I get uh, five dice on handshaking. I got two, three, 
Can we roll on? Oh, I got four dice. Uh, if you pass, he agrees. Improve uh, observation. Awesome. So I get the map four now. Awesome. Um, and that is it for that. No. That is good. Okay. Then I do a mythos. Okay. So we move this here. We have, I know we have one. That's one, two, one, two. Okay. And then we have the reckoning. Um, so we got this one. This doesn't matter. This one. Um, I have to roll a string check. So uh, it's going to be four dice. And um, let's see, so I got two. Okay. And so that's fine. I'm good. All right. Um, and then is there any other ones with any, any more monsters? That have anything? Nope. Okay, no monsters. Ancient one sheet. He's just going to see space. I'm going to see space. So good. Um, then we got advanced Omer by one more. Oh my God. All right. And um, position to conditions. All right. Um, I'm roll my die for my plus. Oh no. So I got to discard this card. That sucks. All right. So. So this is on the bottom. All right, and then I do this one. One die, six. Okay, good. All right, so that's fine. All right, and that's done there. Okay, and then we spawn another gate. Man, it's ours. Oh my god, this is insane. We got three of these. It's not good for us. I need to start getting these gates out of the way. Um, okay, uh, when this monster spawns, move to Amazon. So it goes here. Okay. All right. And um, that's it. Oh, and you can't sleep and can't stop shaking. Compulsively, you open up your suitcase and count everything. Gripping everything you own, you tightly own so tightly your hands bleed. Burn of greed. Event. Each item, each of us game may discard any number of item possessions, then he loses one health for each item possession. He loses one health for each item possession he has. Item. That's going to take, oh my god. So that means I have to take my weapon out. That's blows. Okay. So I will discard that. Down the bottom. I don't think I have any more items. Oh, I do have. I got the whiskey. Um, so I'll take that. Let's go to that too. I don't, I'm not taking any health. So I'll take all of that. Drink it. No, it's different. Alright, so no more. I don't have any items. Okay, so this is done. Alright. Alright, so it's my turn. What do I want to do here? I need to get some of these guys out. Um, so, I'm going to give you a bow token. And, shoot. Um, I'm going to move one, two, and um, take this. I'm going to use that. And, um, Moved. That's my second turn. So now I'm going to do a um, one of these things. Okay. So the dreamlands. In the cavern of flame, the bearded priest Nashed and Commandon warn you that it is too dangerous to continue. You insist that you possess the knowledge you need and are resolved to enter the dreamlands. 
So right now, um, I gain two. So I got three. So minus one. So I have two. Two dice. Okay. Uh, come on, I need to pass this. I need a four, five or six now. And I got it. If you pass, you steal the treasure. All right. All right. Roll one additional die for each clue you have. Oh, okay. So I get one more. All right. Uh, I begin as the dreamlands. You find yourself fighting moon beasts on a black galley sailing to the moon. Strength. Great. I only got two. All right. So. Come on, man. I can do this. I need to need one. Yes, I got two. All right. So I passed. You steal the treasure and you are able to barter with it. Close this gate. Phew. All right. So that's done. Awesome. All right. Close. Discard it. And this is done. All right. So I close one gate. Awesome. That's what I need to do. All right. So next, Mythos. All right. We go here. I don't think I have any green ones yet. No. Okay, good. Um, all right. So we go here. Uh, I need to roll a strength check again for two. And I need to get at least one. And I did not get one. So that makes me lose one health. Okay. Alright, then I need to. Alright, monster is done. Ancient one. I am not in a sea space, or good. And then we best over by one. And then I have to roll another dice if I don't get a one. And I do not, thank God. All right, good. All right. Now that you know what to look for, you see them all around you. The man pretending to be asleep on the bench. The woman watching you in the collection of tobacco in this shop. The trio who has been following you since you left the station. They've been tracking you every move. Eyes everywhere, I bet. Each investigator rolls one die and resolves a matching effect. Four. A monster ambushes you. Oh, great. So now I pick a one. Right. And I got a skeleton. Alright, so I need to roll this so I get three dice. Alright, and uh, I'm getting the sanity taken out. And I got one. I can re-roll one dice. I got two, so I'm good. Alright, uh, strength minus two, so I only get one dice. And I missed. Oh, so that gives me one damage. I'm at two. Wow. Okay. And that's the end of that. Okay, so it's my turn. Of course, I'm going to heal, so I will rest. I'll get one and one. All right. I need to still get one more. All right. And then I'm going to move here. Okay. And that's my uh, turn. Okay, and then I will do an encounter. I will take this one. Let's see, you listen intently as island natives tell a folk tale. So observation. So I get three dice. All right, and I pass. Okay. Pass. You recognize the description of how the elder. Things fought. Guhulu, gain this, gain this clue, and retreat doom by one. Thank you very much. So I'm at seven. All right. So okay, okay. 
I got two clues now. All right. All right. So that's my situational. So now I do this. Okay. There. These sudden thunderstorm. Oh, I'm sorry. I have to move this. So that gives me one. I got two, I think. Yes, two. So one, two. All right. Um, reckoning. Um, we have to roll a string check. So I need two. And I got two. So I'm fine. Didn't get anything there. All right. And then. That's, that's a down one. Right? Okay. Um, oh, and I need to put a address token here. Okay. That sucks, man. Okay. Um, I have to roll one dice. Two. Okay, fine. All right. And then uh, it says this. Okay, so then I do another one of these. Arkham. And let's see. All right. Voltus. Okay, and then um, the sudden thunderstorms have grown more common. Twice a day, rain that smells like seawater floods the streets, and the cold wind, winds that cut like glass threaten to pull down doors off their hinges. We need a triangle. Use an escort rolls to die. Six. One and two, he moves. She's space eight and becomes delayed. Okay, well, I'm done. I'm good. All right. So, there already. I don't have to move in there. Um, Jesus. I need to get that mystery done. Um. to do man um let's see what's this well, I could move over there so I will move here I don't know if I can do no, I can't put that I can't put that set so uh, I'm gonna rest I can't rest either so, um, uh, what I do? Um, I guess I'll get um, a ship token. Okay, I will do that. And then I need to do a counter, so I'm going to do this slug out first. Okay, so I need to roll my mind. So I got two dice. That's not good. All right, so I got. I didn't get any. Wow. I need to try to roll one. Nope. Didn't get any. So I got three. That's, that's good. Then I have to roll and get one dice. I roll for my string check. And I miss, so I get two damage. But I'm only at one. Okay. And that's that. I don't know if I can do. 
So then it's the Methos turn. So we go one, I think we got two. Yeah, two. So one, two. Okay, and then we have, I can get this one. Monster Chariots, Monster Man, East Space Containing Gate, that goes by the Bottom one. Oh, jeez. Monster Surge. Oh, Monster Surge is... Okay, so... Uh, great, so I'm going to get another one over here. On this mountain test Tanaska. That one goes there. And then we got another one over here. And that one goes there. Okay. Okay, and then a clue. And this is gonna go on one. So boom. Okay. When you get there, stop at this address. The nervous little man hands you a business card for a restaurant. Ask for the catch of the day and then tuck a saw buck into your napkin. These guys can get you the answers you need. When you get to the get the bill for your meal, it includes directions to the payphone. It already ringing by the time you find it. You answer and explain and you answer and explain the situation to the gruff voice on the other end of the line, buying information. You bet. Leave in your test handshake and gains a number of clues equal to his own test result. That's pretty good. So I have a total of five. Hopefully I can do this. So I got one, two, I get to roll. No, nope, and I get to re-roll. I got three. So I get three clues. Awesome. So one, two, three. And I got five clues. All right. Boom. Okay. All right. Um. Oh, my turn. The next film is going to be. What's the closest one? That one is. So I have a ship token. So I'm going to move over here. And move over here, use my ship token. All right, and so we got another one. Um, I'm thinking, what do I want to do here? Um, I can't do it. I'll do it in a train. No, I can do another ship token. So I'll grab another ship token. Alright, so I'll take that for now. Alright, and then I do my cultist. So he's got one, so I'm gonna do a strength check by two. Once again, I'm string out two. So I got one. Oh, well, I killed the guy, so he's gone. So this guy is gone. Let's go back in here. So now I do a the future. You stand in Times Square in New York, but not as you know it. The streets are empty and the buildings have crumbled to dust. It appears that you will fail to save the world. And you try desperately not to fall into despair. Mine minus two, so I got uh, three, so I get two dice. Come on, pass. Five or six, man. Five or six. I got two fives. Okay, so I pass. You get to your feet and find it. What is left on the central light? What is left of the central library? The books you find there prove useful. Close this gate. All right, so I have to get closed. Thank you. Uh, deep in the basement of the library, you dig through the archives, search for clues about the downfall of man. So I get uh, four dice. Four dice, I think I'm, yeah. And so 
So we've got one, two, yeah, we've got two. So if you pass, you gain two clues. So I got a total of, wow, I got a lot of clues. All right, so that was a good thing. All right, so that one's done. Um, done back. All right, now do a mythos. All right. Well, moving here. So I have pink one. Yeah, one, one, one. Okay, then I go, oh no, no, it's not good. Uh, space get, no, I'm on C space. Okay, and then we got advanced doom by one. So I'm in zero, boom. Okay, and then we flip this card over. Um, at the last time has come, deep ones have broken the elder sign that kept the master asleep. So, Sulu will rise again, and madness fills the dreams of every living thing. When the three mysteries have been solved, Sulu rises from the sea, spawn the two epic monster and pay, say, pay, Space three. When the food epic mods is defeated, the final mystery is solved and the investigate win the game. When investigate uh manage to the sea. When a man moves into a, a container of elders token, he comes to the loses sanity and places one sanity token on the sheet. On the sheet. Each time Doom would advance, place one sanity token on the sheet instead. He's investigated loses one sanity, each sanity token on the sheet, then And if all set and it's not eliminated, the investigators lose the game. Oh, great. That's going to be tough. All right. Okay. So we did that. We did that. So then um, I have to roll my dice. For this dark pack, hopefully I get a one. Thank you. All right. Um, dark power event. Each monster just covers all health. Then each investigator immediately counters each monster on the spit. On his face in order of his choice. I don't have it, so I'm good. All right. All right. Perfect. Okay, so first thing I need to do is I'm going to heal, rest. Um, so, get one and one. Um, make sure I don't have anything on here to do the resting. Um, I do have, when you perform a rest action, see, so Witch Doctor, investigate on a space where you recover one additional health or discard a curse condition when performing a rest action. So I get one extra health, that's good. And um, I could also do the puzzle box. So I'm going to do that. That's going to be observation, so I got four dice. So two, this is minus two. All right, and hopefully, I got it, I passed. So you may discard this card to gain an artifact. So I'm going to discard this card. All right, I'm just going to go on the bottom. All right. And I'll we'll get artifacts. Let's see what I got. The Cultus de Gurus item tomb. Test lore. If you pass, you may spend one sanity to gain two clues. So I got a lot of clues right now. So I'm kind of good. Um, all right. Um, the next thing I want to do is I can grab. I have a boat. So what do I want to move? Let's see. If we're going to go to. Uh, space and I don't think I have any. Yeah, that's good. We don't have any of those. So, um, but we will have. Let's do this. I have to move there. Really, honestly. I want to see how close that way. So, all right. So I'll go. I'll move here. 
Move here. Okay. And I become delayed. Who? So, enter a space. Each. Uh, so when a message moves into a space containing an elder's token, he may. Becomes delayed, lose one sanity, and place one sanity on the sheet. And so I lose one sanity, so I'll put sanity on this sheet. Okay. And I get delayed. And it's delayed. I delayed ones. Hmm. I'm so delayed in here. Let's see. I'm not delayed in here. So delayed, let me check that real quick on the reference guide. Um, Okay, it comes to lay a later investigate token on the side. Okay. They cannot perform any actions. If an investigate comes to lay on this turn, then the action phase immediately ends its action and there's all remaining actions instead of becoming delayed. Instead of performing actions during the action phase, then he has rights to the investigate token and is no longer delayed. Okay. Alright, so, um, okay, so then I basically am going to do this, um, counter, again, for, uh, it's basically a container, I'll just tell you, you may attempt to fend off the deep one, so I'm going to do that, so I got this, so, um, I got two, three, so I'm going to get two of them, and I got one, but I get three roll one dice, Shoot. so I got one, one ounce, okay, then I got strength minus one, so I got two, so I get one, um, I'm not going to make it. Yeah, I didn't make it. So I get one damage. Great. All right. All right. Now I'm good. All right. So, next thing is going to be that's my ad counter. So I do this. Okay. Um, first of all, we turn this over here. I don't think I have any gates that correspond to, no I don't, alright, and then we do the um, monsters on the game board, this one's fine, then we got, come in here, yes we do, we have the closet. Um so we need to roll a string check. So I get two dice. Hopefully I can get at least one. And I did. Okay, so I'm fine. Um, all right, and then we do another San Francisco. Shoot. And then we do this guy, skeleton. Okay, oh, I forgot. I also have to do these. So, uh, each of these could lose one sanity for each sanity token on the sheet. So, there's one sanity. And then, um, then all these just have eliminated. Okay, this is fine. Okay, and advance omen by one. It says, each time the omen advance, place one sanity token on the sheet. Oh, wow. Okay, so that too. All right, and then we got this. I have to roll a four. I'm fine. 
Good, so this is gone. All right, and uh, oh no, I didn't use it. That's right, didn't use it. Um, okay, and that's it for that. Let's go back here. Um, all right, and we did that. Uh, the wind suddenly picks up, causing a shiver despite the clear blue sky. Looking to the horizon, you are the steely gray clouds approaching. The storm, the event. Each investigator discards clues equal to the number of rumor methods cards in play. So one. Okay, one discard one clue. Uh, if there are no rumors method cards in play, draw one. Okay, so I'll, one rumor that goes from the game box. Okay. Alright, so we, uh, that's it. Done. Okay, so now it's my turn, so I'll basically come back up here. Um, so, good delay. I think that's all I can do. Instead of performing actions during the action phase, then he rescue rights, his investigate token, and is no longer delayed. Okay. Alright, so then I do an encounter. I'm going to probably do that encounter again. So, um, that's, uh, it's going to suck because I don't have anything else I can do. Or I can do the encounter for the, this. I think I'll do that instead because I don't have anything good. And uh, you discover a single fire on a small island, but don't find any people. You search the beach for the signs of life. So I have four dice. Okay. And I pass. You pass, you spot a person hiding behind large stones. Gain one clue. And one random ally asset from the deck. Okay, so I have to do one ally exit on the deck. Ally. Okay. So a large research. If you defund mouse during combat counter, you cover one side and you gain one clue. Okay. Alright, so that's done. That's my counter. Then we do another. I'm looking really bad right now. Alright, so we flip this over. So we got, um, how many of these? We have one, I know. Let's see, no, that's not one. One. Yeah, one. So we get one. Alright, so that's two. Place one side in. Shoot. Okay, probably. Used to be, uh, okay, then we do the. This, uh, each player loses one sanity, each sanity token on the sheet. So, them. Yeah. Alright, so we lost. I totally went insane because of this. Um, uh, totally eliminated. So, that is the end of our game. I knew soon enough I would be, uh, maybe limited to this game. I tried very hard to do it with just one person. But we did pretty good. We've gone through a lot of, uh, Mythos cards. Uh, tried to survive, but couldn't do it. So that is Elvis Horror. I hope you guys enjoy. Well, guys, that, that was Elvis Horror. Um, very difficult game. Um, pretty fun. I like this game. It's a little different than Arkham Horror. Um, got a lot of uh, stuff. I was surprised that Charlie King survived more than he did. He lost more um, sanity than he did health. Didn't die from um, getting getting killed. So. It just got insane. But uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Um, if you haven't subscribed yet again, please hit that subscribe button. If you like the video, please hit the like button. And any comments or suggestions, please put those in, positive and negative. What I can do to improve the uh, channel, please put those in. Um, I will respond to them as soon as I, I get them. Um, also, uh, um, our next video will be um, Nemesis. I just got that game and then I also got um, Voidfall. I just got that today. So we're going to be playing those two games. Voidfall is a little more extensive. 
Um, but uh, I'm really excited about both games, Nemesis and Voidfall. We'll put those on the table and see how that runs. Um, I'm going to go through a few more videos just to get the gist of the rules. And, uh, and uh, if you really want to look at the rules for Voidfall, there is a really good one. Um, I will, I'll, I'll talk about it more when we get into the video. Um, I may even post it on my, um, there's one uh, guy, English guy that does a lot of good explanation of the games. He did really, a really good one for Voidfall. So um, I, I forget the guy's name, and I'll, I'll get that for you on the next video. All right, so uh, take care, guys, and uh, have a great day.